Hello everyone! I'm your teacher, Jesse, and today we will read the book Fur. Fur. What is fur? Hmm. Do you see this animal? What animal is this? It's a cat. Cat, right. And a cat has something on its body. What is this? Hair? No. People have hair. An animal has fur. Yes, this is fur. All right, look at your book, fur. The letters F U R feel like fur. Manjoba. Yes, that's fur. Let's read more about fur. In the book by Ian Douglas. Are you ready? Let's go! Hmm, what animals are these? They have funny eyes. Look at their eyes. Dodukchorom, nuni boyoyo. Don't they? Yes, they look like robbers. But they're not robbers. Doduk anieyo. No, what animals are these? They are raccoons. Do you know what I said? Raccoons. Say it after me. Raccoons. Raccoons. Excellent. These raccoons also have fur. F-U-R. Fur. Raccoons have fur. What? color is the raccoon's fur? It is white and gray and black. Yes, raccoons have fur. All right, now look at the pictures on this page. First, let's look at these animals here. Oh, kiyopjo. They're very cute. Yes, they're very cute. And these animals are cheetahs. These are baby cheetahs. What color is the cheetah's fur? Orange. Right, the cheetahs have orange fur. And it's also, what about right here? White. White, yes, they have orange and white fur, but <gasps> There's one more color. What color is What color are those? Black. Very good. Those are black spots. Just like the cheetah. Those are called spots. S P O T spot. A cheetah has many black spots. What animal is this? This is a llama. A llama has long fur. Right? Look at this fur. Chincha giroyo. Right? It is really long. Long brown fur. It has long brown fur and it has long white fur. Yes, good job. A llama has long brown and white fur. And what about this animal? Oh, kiyoyo. It's so cute, right? This animal is very cute. Kiyoyo, cute. What color is this animal's fur? White. Excellent. Yes, this also has white fur. And this animal is called a... <coughs> a seal. A seal has white fur.
almost all mammals have hair. All right, almost all, almost all. Do all animals have hair? No, almost all. Fur is a kind of hair. See, this is hair. Fur is a kind of hair. Okay, hankaji. Many mammals have fur. Many mammals have fur. Cheetahs have fur. Llamas have fur. Right? Yes. Cats have fur. Dogs have fur. Many mammals have fur. What's a mammal? A mammal is a kind of animal. Okay? A chicken, a llama, a cheetah, a dog, a horse, a tiger. Those are all mammals. Fur keeps mammals warm. Mm. Fur de mone, mammal, da de teo. Right? They keep you warm. If the cheetah has no fur, chuogitta, it would be cold. Right? Tol opsumyon chupgitta. Right? Fur keeps mammals warm. Oh, what are these? Do you remember? These are. Did you say llamas? Very nice. Good job. Yes. Here are many llamas, right? One llama has dark fur, one llama has white fur, and these llamas have orange fur. Right. Where are the llamas? The llamas are near the mountain. Yes, the llamas are near the mountain. And it looks like a very nice day. Nalshiga. Donga boyo. It looks hot. Maybe the llamas are too hot. Now let's read about the seal. Sometimes it keeps them safe. Ah, yes. Where does a seal live? Mulke ka odiso salayo? Mmm. Chun go se so. A seal lives with lots of snow. Nuni manko and ice. Okay? Ice do manayo. Right? What color is snow? Snow is white. And the seal is white. Katten sekal de mone, anjon heo. Sometimes it keeps them safe. Safe means wihom hango opsoyo. There's nothing dangerous. Why? He can hide. The seal can hide. What animal is this? Do you know? Is it a mouse? No, it's not a mouse. This is a squirrel. Can you say that after me? Squirrel. A little bit difficult, right? Oliopto. One more time. Squirrel. Fantastic. All right. And what is this long thing on the squirrel? This is the squirrel's tail. Hori, right? That is the tail. And the tail is wrapped around the squirrel, right? Here's the squirrel. The tail is wrapped around the squirrel. Why? Hmm. Let's find out. Squirrels have fur. See, the squirrel has fur. They wrap their furry tail around themselves. Uh huh. See? Furry tail. Tol manen hori. Furry tail. And the squirrel wraps the furry tail around himself. Why? This keeps them warm. Aha. Gyoul te ibul chorom hori. Gadu te. Because of their furry tail, the squirrel is. Warm, yes. Chon se ga gineo, squirrel. 
Good idea. <laughs> I wish I had a furry tail. Furry tail 있으면 좋겠어요. What animal is this? Yo. Right. In English, do you know what it is? We say Did you say fox? Nice! Yes, it is a fox. And look at this. A fox has a furry tail too. Yes, see, it's a furry tail. The fox has orange hair and a furry tail. Orange fur, not orange hair. Orange fur and a furry tail. And just like the squirrel, the fox wraps his tail around himself. Okay? Squirrel처럼. Tail is wrapped around his body. Why? To keep To keep warm, yes. Foxes do this too. Mm -hmm. Squirrel 같아. The fox wraps its tail around its body. Good idea, fox. <laughs> And that is the end of part one of fur. I'll see you next time for part two. Bye bye! Hello everyone! It's your teacher, Jesse, back with part two of the book Fur. Do you remember part one? Part one, we saw some cat with fur, and we saw a llama with fur, and a seal with fur, and some baby cheetahs with fur. Now we have another cat with fur. But what is the cat doing? The cat is licking its fur, right? The cat licks, L-I-C-K. The cat will lick its fur. Why? Mashisoyo? Is it yummy? No, pleh, mad up soyo. It's to be clean, okay? The cat cleans its fur. Gega tail. Shisoyo. All right? The cat cleans its fur. So now its fur is clean. How do you clean? Right. You wash in the shower, or you wash in the bath. But a cat doesn't shower. No! A cat licks its fur. Let's read about the cat. Cats have fur. Cats lick, lick their fur. This keeps it clean. Gigutajo. Yes, the cat's fur is very clean. Why? Not from a shower. No, because it licked the fur. Very good. Lick. Now we have a different animal. Do you remember this one? We saw some baby animals of this one in part one. This is a big one. It's a... Yes, it's a cheetah! And what is the cheetah doing? Moheo? Mmm, koyangi torom. Like the cat, it is licking its fur. Yes, a cheetah licks its fur too. How does it lick its fur? What is this? Do you know? The cat has a. Uh, the cheetah has a uh, I have a uh, and you have a uh. What is it called? It's called a T O N G U E tongue. Say that after me. Tongue. tongue. Excellent. Let's read about the cheetah and how it licks its fur. Cheetahs do this too. What is this? Koyangi 
lick its fur. Like the cat, the cheetah licks its fur too. Cheetah do lick its fur. Cheetahs do this too. Why? Why does a cheetah lick its fur? So it can be clean. Very good. Here is another animal that licks its fur. See? Here is a tiger. And a tiger also has a tongue. Right? Here's the tiger's tongue. What does the tiger do? The tiger, mm, its fur. The tiger, its fur. The tiger, its fur. The tiger licks its fur. Perfect. Yes. The tiger also licks its fur. And cheetahs do this too. All right, so we have cats that lick its fur, we have cheetahs that lick their fur, and we have a tiger that licks its fur. Many animals lick their fur to be clean. Now, what animals are these? <laughs> do you know? Yumso. This is a goat. These animals are goats, and goats also have some fur. See, the goats have fur. <gasps> Look what this goat has. What are these? Do you know what those are? <clears throat> those are called horns. H-O-R-N-S. A goat has horns. Yes. And a goat has fur. This goat has white fur. Mountain goats have fur. Ooh, these are special goats. They are mountain goats. Saneso saraso. Iyomsudri san yomsu. Mountain goats. Mountain goats have fur. Their fur keeps them warm. Mm-hmm. Saneso kakum chuoso. The fur keeps them warm. Tolte mune tadateo. Mountain goats shed warm fur in spring. Shed? What does this mean? Shed. Shed means boso. Okay? Nomu domion. Koturu otoke hajo? Bosoyo. Right. Goats can shed their fur. In the spring, bome. Tol bosoyo. It comes off. We say shed. Mountain goats shed, shed their fur in spring. Boom. Spring. Mm-hmm. Dowaso, fur comes off. They shed their fur. Oh, look at these animals. Do you know these animals? Sanageso, sanun, camel. Say it after me. Camel. Very good. Look at this camel. Some fur is on, some fur is off. Apayo. Anapayo. No, it doesn't hurt. Quinchanayo. Apajianayo. Nomudo so. This camel is shedding its fur. Okay? It's very hot. So the camel sheds its fur. See, look. Look at this camel. No fur. Why? Because it's very. Did you say hot? Nice. Yes. It's hot. So the camel sheds its fur. See? Camels do this too. Camels shed their fur too. Mountain goat 처럼 camel도 shed their fur. Where's the animal? 
There's no animal here. 그냥 잔디만 보여. There is an animal? Where? Oh, can you see the eyes? Touch the eyes. Where are the eyes? Yes, oh, look at that. There are the eyes. What animal is this? Can you see? This, wow, is a lion. The lion is hiding in the grass. How can the lion hide? Because its fur is the same color as the grass. Yes, 털은 잔디와 같은 색깔이 있어서 hide. 할수 있어요. It can hide. Lions have fur. Their fur helps them hide. Right? Yeah. Lions blend into the background. Okay? Blend means 같이 있어요. Blend. Okay? Into the background. 여기 background는 잔디. Okay. 고문 background는 숲속. Right? 사람 background는 도시. 집. Lion background는 잔디. Lions blend into the background. Why? Because their fur helps them hide. Wow, 신기하죠? That's amazing! What animal is this? Sasum. In Korean, it's sasum. In English, it's deer. Deer. Say it with me. Deer. Nice. Look at this deer. Its fur is brown and a little bit yellow. And the grass and the rocks are also brown and yellow. The deer's fur helps it hide, just like the lion. Deer do this too. 사자처럼 Deer 털 hide 할수 있어요. Deer do this too. Deer hide with their fur too. Oh ho ho! Here is another animal that can hide with its fur. Do you remember this animal? Mm-hmm. It's a cheetah, right? The cheetah's fur is yellow and orange, and the grass and the rocks and the sun are yellow and orange, so the cheetah can hide. Did you say hide? Incredible! Wow! Good work! And just like the tiger and just like the cheetah, deer can hide with their fur too. Mm -hmm. All right, that is the end of part two of fur. I'll see you soon for part three. Hello! I'm your teacher, Jesse, and I'm back with part three of fur. Okay? So far, we learned about how fur can keep an animal warm. And we learned how some animals clean their fur. Right? How do they clean their fur? They lick their fur. And some animals can hide with their fur, like this animal. This animal is called a snow hare. Santoki. Santoki nun snow hare. It's not a rabbit. Rabbit, gnyang toki. Santoki nun snow hare. Okay? Its ears are longer and its feet are longer. Okay, it has longer ears and feet than a rabbit. Toki boda, kuido, paldo, do giroyo. Mm-hmm. And what color is the hare's fur? It is white, right? Yes, it's white. Why? 
What is the background? The background is snow. What color is snow? It is white. Wonderful. Yes. So the snow hair can hide in the background. Snow hairs have fur. In winter, they grow a white coat. Coat? You don't coteo? No. Fur coat. Mm hmm. Kotunun. Tolo. Mandroyo. This makes them hard to see against the snow. Nuni manaso. Pogiga. Oliowoyo. Himdroyo. Krutjo. Hard to see. Pogiga. Oliowoyo. Oh, odiga soyo. Odi, odi soyo. You can't see it. Why? Because the snow hare's fur is white and the snow is white. The snow hare can hide in the snow because of its fur. Here are some more hares, but oh, they aren't white, they're brown. Why? Nuni opsoso tol sekari bakkoyo. Okay, in the spring, and in the summer, the snow hare's fur is brown. Why? Because there's no snow. Bomdo yoromedo nuni opsoso toli bakkoyo. It changes to brown. Oh, ho, ho, very amazing. Here is our snow hare again, and again it's white. Why? Because the snow is white. Here is another animal that's white with the white snow. What animal is this? Yo. Yes, it's a fox, but it's a special fox. It's called an Arctic fox. Arctic un nomu chundeo. Yes, it's a very cold place with lots of snow. So the fox is white, so it can hide in the snow. Arctic foxes do this too. Arctic foxes have white hair, just like the snow hair. They have white fur, just like the snow hair, so they can hide in the snow, like the snow hair. Snow hair chorom, santoki chorom, Arctic fox do hide in the snow with their white fur. Next, we have this animal. Ooh, what is this guy? Manjimyeon apgesoyo. If you touch it, it will, ouch! Aya, it hurts, apayo. Right, it hurts if you touch this animal. This animal is called a porcupine. And a porcupine has fur, see? Here's some fur. But here, this is special. That's not fur, no. Those are quills. And those keep the porcupine safe. Anjon temune, right? Darun domuri, mokko shibumyon, apugesuyo. Yeah. Porcupines have fur. They have soft fur underneath their prickly spines. Okay, yes, see? Yogi nun, soft fur. Fur. This is soft fur. Budoroun tol. But, yoginun, wa, prickly spine. Ouch! It hurts. Mm -hmm. They use their prickly spines to keep safe. Maybe I am a fox. Mmm, porcupine mashikita. That porcupine looks yummy. Ouch! Apayo. Right? The porcupine is safe. Anjanheo. And here is another picture of a porcupine. Look at those prickly spines. Wow! They are very zhup, 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 long. Giloyo. Right? They are very. Long. And they are very. Ding, ouch! 
They are very sharp. Sharp, right? Kalchorom, sharp. Mandimion, ouch, apayo, right? They are very sharp. The porcupine's prickly spines are long and sharp. Here's our porcupine again with long, sharp, prickly spines. What animal is this? It's not a porcupine. No, a porcupine has long prickly spines. But look at this guy. They're very short, right? These prickly spines are short. Yes, this is a hedgehog, okay? A porcupine is a little bit big. A hedgehog is a little bit small. And a hedgehog's prickly spines are short, but a porcupine's prickly spines are long. Hedgehogs do this too. What do they do? They stay safe because of prickly spines. Prickly spines de mune, anjon heo, porcupine chorom. Hedgehogs do this too. Hedgehog do kuruke heo. Here is another hedgehog. See? Short prickly spines. Porcupines, long, hedgehogs, short. And where's the hedgehog's head? Mori odieo? Mmm, it's inside. See? The hedgehog made a ball. Why? Gobi manumyon. Iroke heo. Why? Anjon heo. It makes a ball to stay safe. Mm. 무서운 동물 보면 이렇게 하고 safe 해요. He stays safe. Hedgehogs do this too. Just like the porcupine, a hedgehog is safe because of its prickly spines. Ooh, now it's time for a quiz. Let's match the different kinds of fur with the different kinds of animals, okay? 돌 여러 가지 있고, 동물도 여러 가지 있어요. How about this one? It's black and white. Hmm, is it the same as this? No, this is a zebra. But a zebra has stripes, right? Stripes. This is not a stripe. This is very soft. This is this one here. It is called a skunk. 냄새 나는 동물이요. 이름이 skunk. S-K-U-N-K. Skunk. Ew, 냄새. It stinks. <laughs> 냄새는 stinks. It smells. That's a skunk. Now, here is some more black and white fur. Hmm, is it the zebra or the cow? So ina zebra. Cow? Very good, yes, right? The zebra has stripes, right? It has stripes, these aren't stripes. No, that is a cow's fur. So nun cow. C O W. Cow. Moo. That's a cow. Mm hmm. Next one. Oh, do you remember what these are? These are prickly spines. What animals have prickly spines? Ah? Porcupine? Perfect. And ah? Uh, Hedgehog, yeah, incredible. Here is the hedgehog, and the hedgehog has prickly spines. Great job. All right, the last one. Look at this fur. What kind of fur is this? Yes, black and white, and it has 
stripes, right? S T R I P E, stripes. Okay. A cheetah has boop, 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 spots, and a zebra has zoop, 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 stripes. The stripe fur is for the zebra. All right, that's everything from the book Fur. You did a fantastic job. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.